Local 33's Health Minutes are brought to you by Mattress Direct. Aspirin regimens are now no longer being recommended to prevent heart disease or stroke for healthy older Americans. New research showing it can cause severe bleeding inside of your skull. Thanks to that new information, the American Heart Association and American College of Cardiology have changed their recommendation guidelines. Reed Binion has more in this morning's Health Minute. The risks of an aspirin regimen for someone without heart disease may actually outweigh the benefits. Taking a daily low-dose aspirin to help combat heart attacks and stroke might increase your risks of severe bleeding in your brain. In an analysis of past studies of over 130,000 people aged 42 to 74 given a low-dose aspirin or placebo, those who took the placebo had a 0.46% risk of having bleeding inside their skulls. For those who took a low-dose of aspirin, the risk was 0.63% of developing bleeding in the brain. People from Asian backgrounds and those with a body mass index under 25 had the highest risk. A low-dose daily aspirin regimen had been recommended for older adults, thanks to aspirin's ability to prevent platelets from forming a clot in the arteries. With this new evidence, aspirin is no longer recommended to prevent heart disease for healthy older adults who don't have a high risk of developing or already have existing heart disease and may just be a waste of money or worse. It could even raise your risk of internal bleeding or bring on an early death. For today's Health Minute, I'm Reed Binion.